Thanks for letting me know. <laughs> That's what that was. That was me having my mic muted. Try to, I was trying to figure out what was happening. And I was going to cast the other game, but then this one was going. So I was like, screw it. I'll cast it what I can from this, and then hopefully I'll catch the last map of the other one. So this is Frel versus uh, a Lazy's team. So for Blood Eagle, I have E-Grab, Ponfar, Implosions, Voss, Archimedes, Dracula, and Aegis. And for Diamond Sword, we have Firebad, Clemson Guy, Seek, Lazy, Word Thompsonian, Urtiza, and Hassel Huff, who usually plays the Huff. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> Now that that's all figured out, we're watching the Blood Eagle side of things right here. I'm not sure anyone's seen Hasselhoff coming up from behind. He does take a soldier jump. Not sure why. And he just dies. So that's it for that. They kind of ran into all the Blood Eagle team that spawned up there. That's one of the reasons why you keep it there. Uh, these guys are a little bit further back. Not sure why. It seems like this is a better choice. But, hey, whatever. This is why I don't play. <laughs> But hopefully it's better now. Let me know if anything's not working correctly. Dracula coming in from the front. He is alone. Meanwhile, over on the other side, Diamond Sword is going after the Kappa right now. Here comes Hasselhoff up, up above Urtiza in his face. Hasselhoff is going to miss the conk. Gets taken out by a grenade. Urtiza is still alive. Lazy trying to toss what he can up there. Grenades and a couple of pistol shots. Voss is still in good shape. Firebat has dropped the flag. Taken up by a disc. Here comes E-Grab for the return. Gets it just before Clemson guy gets the kill. So Voss coming back to with his uh, flag here for Blood Eagle. There is an E-Grab coming in. It's going to be Hasselhoff, but he's taken out by Pond Far. And Voss gets the cap. It's one to nothing in favor of Blood Eagle, which has pretty much been the theme tonight. Pretty much been the theme. Not gonna lie. Um, I do want to turn this up though. There we go. That's better. All right. So one to nothing. Two a twenty. I can't talk. Twenty forty. Left here on map number one, Arch Novena. Map number two will be. Oh Jesus! Here we are. Damn it. Map number two is gonna be Rain Dance. Son of a bit. Oh, I shouldn't even. I I shouldn't even had to look. I just, it's gonna be Rain Dance. Sure enough, it is. Akis coming into the back. He hasn't been spotted. He does get his regen coming in for Blood Eagle. The Hoff on that stand, but he hops up and over the flag, and Akis, Akis scoots on through underneath. Seek, meanwhile, with a grab on the other side. Cappers are gonna pass each other. Seek squeezes off the shot, but he's gonna miss. Both, uh, at least, uh, whoever that is. Yeah, Akis has full health. Seek, meanwhile, 48, took a snipe just underneath the hill. The, uh, bridge there. Clemson guy picks it up. He's getting drilled in the face by a disc. E-Grab e -grab does get the last bolt action out of him. But he does go down. Flag drop. Lazy picks it up. Tosses it up the hill. Here comes Implosions off of the top. He pants the return. Huge return by Implosions coming in. He just kind of ignored the flag there for a second. And Dracula is going to get that cap. Blood Eagle takes the lead. Two, two, nothing. Beep. Yes. I know, Red Sentinel, and the reason being is because my monitor is 1610, and Twitch needs it to be 16.9 for it to take up the entire screen. I could stretch the image, but it just wouldn't look good if you really, if the side bars really bothered you. It it shouldn't. It really shouldn't. As long as it's in in the correct ratio, it should be okay. I'm sorry, I cut out maybe an inch of your computer <laughs> monitor. But yeah, that is a known. It is known, Khaleesi. Akis with a grab here for Blood Eagle. Through midfield, I saw the sniper line up his shot. First one's going to miss. Second one does hit. 46 health. Ba bow There's the second flag. Meanwhile, the flag was grabbed by CK. He's going to go down in front of the base of Blood Eagle. And E-Grab does the return. Meanwhile, this flag is out in the field. Clemson guy 
gets the return. Meanwhile, flag picked up by Word Thompsonian there. He's going to toss it up and over the Blood Eagle defense there. But it's going to be returned by Egrab just before Atiza can get there. So that is going to be returned. Still 2 nothing. 18 minutes to go here. Map number one. Arcs Novena. There's Dracula coming in. He's going to toss grenades all over. Word Thompsonian is in the bike. He's in a Raider. Screw skiing when you can take a bike. Oh, don't crash it. <laughs> you better watch yourself there. Going back over here. One thing I do want to do real quick. Sorry, guys. There we go. Much better. Now I can control camera fluidly. Here comes where Tom Sony in onto the completely clean. No one saw him, and he's off. Coming back out, there is E Grab giving chase. Bolt to the back, pushes him up 150. He gets through. But now he's up in there. Here comes that chain gun fire. Pont Far gets a shot off. Going to drop him down. Takes a huge bounce. Oh, e grab freaking pancakes. Not able to get the return. But here comes Dracula going for it. Here comes Word Thompsonian coming in from the grenade fire. And no! <coughs> Dr. Thompsonian able to kill Dracula right before the return was made. So no dice. Pont Far, meanwhile, taking pot shots at Urtiza. Drops him down to 160, but he's going to drop it off for a teammate. We're Thompsonian and Seek are there. Meanwhile, Archimedes has gotten out for Blood Eagle. He's getting away. He's going to toss it up and over. Clemson guy giving chase, going for the return now. It's up. No. Voss with the MA grab in front of Clemson guy. He goes down from Voss. And Bob Al, both, flag, both teams out with the flag. Missed toss right there. Here comes Ponfar. Ortiza giving. No. Denied. Ponfar gets chained out by just about everybody. And the kitchen sink. Here comes Egrab. Gets taken out. Lots of conks, lots of chain fire, lots of discs and bolts. Ba -ba 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 flag standoff with 16 minutes to go here in map number one. Diamond Sword setting up shop. And back over on the other side, Blood Eagle once again on top of their spawn sniper hill. As we pull back to see the entire map, here goes Arteza down below. There comes Lazy across, tossing down a inventory station. Clemson guy moving in. Implosions seeing Lazy. He's going right after him. And there's Clemson and Lazy all there as Implosions trying to toss grenades on that inventory station to bring it down. Not going to happen. Meanwhile, Urtiza snuck in as Blood Eagle left Ponfar alone. But Ponfar able to take out Urtiza there. Meanwhile, over on the other side, it's Word Thompsonian trying to get away from the Blood Eagle offense. There's Egrab coming in the front as the toss off to Seek now has it, moving back to, but he's all alone. Firebat is behind him, but he's got no health. There's the conk. The flag is out. Egrab, not going to happen. No health, and he's all alone. Meanwhile, over on the other side, I do see some Diamond Sword lining up for the attack. Hasselhoff and Lazy are on the base just in case that flag gets returned. Kind of camping the stand right now, but no dice. Hasselhoff now getting dueled out by Akis on top of the stand. Lazy ran in alone, got caught between Voss and Ponfar. Here comes Urtiza in the back, up and over. Here he comes. Here comes the grenades. Here comes the discs. And Clemson guy coming in from behind. Hasselhoff gets taken out. Didn't have a whole lot of health to begin with. Implosions. It looks like Ponfar able to take out Urtiza. And boom, boom, Clemson guy goes down from Voss. Meanwhile, over on the other side for Diamond Sword. Uh, Dracula and Egrab coming in. Akis is right there trying to time the conk. There's the conks out from Egrab. Not going to happen. Akis is there. Misses the conk, but Firebrad... Firebat has no health. He grab is there. He's going to try to toss it up to the top of the mountain. And here comes Archimedes. And Archimedes gets that return for Blood Eagle. Here comes Implosions. Back to the flagstand. But there's an E-Grab Arteza. Meanwhile, oh my god, what is happening? Implosions still good and dandy. Chilling on top of his base, it looks like. We're going to follow Ortiza now, who's getting chased from behind by... Who is that? It's going to be Akis. He's able to pull a right turn here, but he's run into Archimedes and Egrab. And there's Egrab with that holdout shotgun. Urtiza able to take on Archimedes. Now down to 376 in that soldier. Misses the punt, but it's going to go right into Word Thompsonian here. So Word Thompsonian here has it, but the Egrab with a beautiful conk, but it's taken out by Word Thompsonian when he tries to get down the hill. Ake is coming in from behind, gets the conk, but it kills him as well. And Word Thompsonian still trying to move this across the base. And there goes Egrab with the conk and the return. 
And just like that, I am out of breath. Diamond Sword is denied once again. Archimedes' real name is Mr. Salt. Thank you very much, but I prefer Archimedes because that is my favorite Disney character of all time. So there. Mm. Sword in the Stone, baby, is uh, the best. Word Thompsonian at midfield dropping some inventory stations. I do see Dracula soldier. This can't be a route. He might be going for Firebad the sniper, who's just popping shots of Akis, who's leaving on a route. As indeed he goes right at the Firebad, and it looks like Firebad does get taken out by Doctor Ac uh, Arcula. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Dracula, Aegis, 56 health coming in. Gets his regen in time, though. So here he comes. Let's see if Blood Eagle can clear this base a little bit more. Urtiza coming in. Didn't uh, see the capper coming in. And Aegis is out with that flag and moving away. Let's see if he can get the bounce. He does through midfield. But, the, however, the flag was picked up by Seek for Diamond Sword. Who makes it all the way back to the base. He's going to toss off the Lazy. And here comes Implosions with the Bolts. And beautiful job by Lazy. Able to chain him down. Archimedes. Mr. Salt if you say so. Coming up. And he just runs right into all of Diamond Sword. My goodness. Oh no. I'm good dude. This is how I do it. That's how I do it. That's how I do it. Word Thompson. Got to pick it up for Diamond Sword. He is good. No, he's not. Incoming. Look out. Oh, midair conk almost by E-Grab. Not going to happen. It's where Thompsonian still good. Shaped. Uh, here comes uh, Dracula coming in from behind. <coughs> he's in a soldier, so no <coughs> no chance of a conk there. Here comes Akis, who is in a light. He hasn't been spotted, as is Archimedes. The flag is conked. Gets out. Archimedes was there, but not able to get it. Mr. Salt, you are fired, sir. And he's going to get chained out by Lazy. No dice. Meanwhile, over on the other side... Hey, he's out. Flag is down. Implosions. Going for the return. No. He dies on the flag. There goes Firebrad for the return. I screwed that up. Lazy. Coming back to his base, but E-Grab right there for the E-Grab. Love it when their names do that. It makes my job so much easier. E-Grab. 820 through midfield. Oh, grenade almost went off in his face. Urtiza trying to bring him down, but not going to happen. Shotgun going off, not going to hit anything. He's too far away for that. And Lazy has dropped the flag over on the other side. Oh, my God, what's happening again? Flaggers return on the other side. I totally screwed that up. And Hasselhoff is going to be there in a fat suit. Brute for the E-Grab. Trying to move away now to 295 health. He's going to toss it off for Urtiza, who just gets destroyed by a conk. And Hasselhoff gets MA'd and then chain gun down by implosions. But Firebad swoops in from the front out of nowhere. Gets the punt off. Can it get over? No, it's up on top of the bridge. Clemson guy is going to get it and try to run with it. Meanwhile, the flag returned. The E grab suffices. And Diamond Sword gets the return. So if Clemson guy can take out his two chasers here, he gets one. And now he's got a full health pathfinder. It's E grab up above. He does get conked. Flag is down. Clemson guy all alone with the E-Grab. He does get the return. Weird Thompsonian just not able to get there in time. We have a Shrike, maybe? Yes, indeed. It's going to be Urtiza. Moving through midfield here. Let me move my mic back a little bit. Huzzah. That's better. And Dracula with a grab here for Blood Eagle. Taking a weird-ass route there. Without that bounce, it's just a super slow-mo. Uh, Aqueduct. Yes, Lazy with an E-grab there for Diamond Sword. He's away. 234. Pawn far trying to let him up with a sniper. Two shots have missed. Oh, misses the third. Hit the bridge, and Lazy gets through. And now he's back into line of sight, and boom. Pawn far doesn't miss the fifth, fourth attempt, I think. And Arteza picks it up. Clemson guy is going to keep it for Diamond Sword. Meanwhile, over on the other side, there's implosions. Looking good. Pretty quiet over here. Both teams resetting, it looks like. Music's not bad. This is in-game. This is Tribes of Send Music. Lazy has dropped the flag. That was a conk. 
Soup Seek picks it up. Egrab is up in the air. He has no health. Gets the conk, though, but no one is there for the return. Meanwhile, the flag dropped over on the other side. There it is. Down. Ponfar trying to drop on it. Doesn't get it. It's still out. Clemson guy gets that return. I keep fucking that up. Seek coming back to his base. Kim Diamondsword get the cap. Archimedes coming in. And a fatty drops the mortar on the flag. But Seek able to get the cap. Two to one. And Diamond Sword, which is Lazy's team, on the board for only the second time tonight, I believe. 2 to 1, 7.35 to go here. Archimedes at midfield, tossing some orders off for Word Thompsonian and Lazy. I'm going to laugh if it's Word Thompson Land. Just all game long. We're Thompsonian is just easier to say. That's how it's in my head, and that's how it shall stay. We did have a grab by somebody. Who was it? Not entirely sure. It might have been E-grab, but it's out in front of the Blood Eagle base. There's a crash for it. Voss gets the grab, though. He's up in the air. Clemson guy, no, dies right before he can make that return. That was a close one. Meanwhile, Dracula trying to come in. There's Firebad. Dracula. And with a keep it secure and good. Turn down my camera speed a little bit. Hasselhoff. And a fatty. In the back. Here comes our Akis out of nowhere. The conk is down, but he misses one. Hasselhoff is up in the air. He's all alone. You got to time that better, my friend. Just a wee bit better. Nope, nope, nope. Nope, nope, nope. Meanwhile, back on the other side, Voss here for Blood Eagle. Lots of chain gun fire going off. Clemson guy coming in. Whoop. Nope. Not going to happen. Implosions and Ponfar clean up the rest of the offense. Give a run. Look at the scores. Why don't we hear? Ponfar leading the way with 26. Lazy nipping at his heels with 25. It's kind of interesting. You see who all the old players are and the new players. Ponfar, level 28. I mean, I mean, let's be perfectly honest. It's, it's probably a, uh, a smurf, but whatever. As Lazy has it for Diamond Sword now, trying to get away. He's actually chasing Dracula. As Word Thompsonian and Seat come in. E-grab now with some disc spam. Long distance disc spam. Fairly accurate, though. Implosions goes down. The flag is out in the back by the V-pad aqueduct. It is down. Ponfar trying to go for the return. Here comes Voss. Ponfar able to pick it up. He goes down, but Firebat is going to get that return. And Clemson guy able to mop up everybody. Here comes Dracula onto the flag stand. Can he get through for the E-grab? He dies as everybody just died on that flag stand. Ink is trying to give Chase Lazy with full health. He's going to toss it off to Firebat. And he's going to be able to pick it up looking fine and dandy. The flag returned at midfield by Arteza, and here comes Diamond Sword. No, it's going to be picked up, returned, dead, died, Voss, and E-Grab. E-Grab gets the ridiculous return after what a push from a Blood Eagle. My goodness in hell, 425 to go here on map number one, Arch Novena. That was intense, fellas. Oh, I miss seeing all, like, I look back to see the replay, and it was just death everywhere. It just hits everywhere. Two to one, Blood Eagle denies Diamond Sword the equalizing cap as we approach the four-minute mark. RT Sports, that's right. Here comes Seek from behind. He has absolutely no clear. He has been seen. It is known. And you are owned, sir. Voss. Ridiculous MA on an incoming capper. 
As now here comes Diamond Sword. Their capper is super late. No, here comes Ward Thompsonian. I lied! And he, I did not notice they were running double cap. Beautiful job at Ward Thompsonian. He is out looking good. He does get sniped by Ponfar once and twice. Drops him down to 350, but we have a clean grab by Akis down to 585. Ward Thompsonian, he has suicided. Flag is down. Diamond Sword has a beat on it, but no implosion goes in for the return. Here comes Akis. Blood Eagle Bow, bow, pushes their lead back to two. Slams the door shut with three minutes to go. <laughs> they haven't locked it just yet, but E grab with a grab for um, Blood Eagle here. Just moving away in a Pathfinder. 900 health. Chang of Fire hits him just a little bit, drops him down to 774. Clemson guy, disc jump, giving chase. Here comes Archimedes and Dracula for the cover. He gets taken up by Clemson guy who swoops in and gets that return. So Diamond Sword has to get it off the stand at least and get it moving. Here comes Ortiz, taken up by Voss just seconds before Lazy can kill Voss. As here comes C, clean grab off the flag stand for Diamond Sword. That bolt fire just nearly misses. 706 takes the rock bounce back to his base. E grab giving chase. Flag is secure. Flag stand cap pushing it back to with win one. 215 to go. And this, you know, this is what I hate about this map is that people just won one camper and then the game picks up and it's fun and exciting when there's two. Ha! Ah, Firebad gets the grab and, like, that's why the last five minutes of Arsenal Vita is usually the best of the entire map. Three to two. We have passed the two minute mark. Here we go. One cap. One cap separates the two teams. We have a grab by Ortiz and for Diamond Sword. It was left alone in the corner as, as everybody just kind of K'd out. And Ortiz are trying to move it past midfield. E-grab gets that return. I don't see a capper. There's Firebad leaving on a route. Meek! Soup. Oh, wow. Excuse me. Ooh, that felt good. Seek moving through clean. 900 health. E grab by Dracula, though, over on the other side. Seek back to his base. Dracula has dropped the flag over at midfield. Ortiz and Clemson guy all over it. They get the return. Where's the base? There it is. There's Lazy. Flag stand. And this ball game is tied with a minute 10 to go. 3-3 three to three here on Arx Novena. There's Firebad moving through midfield. E-Grab is there. Can they stop him? Not looking good. Blood Eagle is nowhere to be found. Can Dracula at least get it off the stand? Here comes Akis for a suicide crash. Flag is right there. Picked up. He gets through. Holy crap by Akis. That gives Blood Eagle enough time to go for the crash. There's Clemson guy up in the air. Chain gun fire not able to connect, and Akis is still moving away with this flag. Oh my goodness, looks like Diamond Sword is going for the standoff here. Next cap wins. They want to make sure this thing stays home. 20 seconds to go. This thing's going to go to OT. We do have Akis here with no health. Firebad has caught up to him. Voss and E-Grab are there for the cover. He's only got 13 health. Firebad now getting taking some fire. There it is. Akis, he's able to take him out. Firebad moving through. Finally, three discs from Voss, E-Grab, and Archimedes all taken down. But here comes Ward Thompsonian and Ortiza. Archimedes and E-Grab need to keep him safe. It's a bunch of soldiers versus uh, or Pathfinder versus Pathfinders, and they pretty much just screwed that up. Lazy now, all alone versus Dracula. He's going to toss it off to Clemson. The toss-off misses. Here comes Implosions over the top. He's got a sliver. Blood Eagle with the return. Voss moving back to his base. He's in the new no! Fireband swoops in and gets the return. Oh, my goodness. We are officially now into OT, and Akis puts it very well with you shit. Oh, I'm going insane. This is e this is what I miss. You get none of this in MOBAs. None of this. None. Can't wait to do this for Rocket League. Huge crash coming in from Diamond Sword. Word Thompsonian is all that's left. 
He gets drilled from behind. Here comes Seek. Able to come through with a double spin. He's off and clean. 900 health and gone. Ponfire lights him up once. His second shot misses. Third shot misses. He's back to his base. Implosion swooping in. He dies on the flash stand. Dracula is there. Seek tries to toss it off, but no one is there. He grab and Dracula trying to swoop in for the return. It's up. It's over. I'm dying. Lazy gets the grab, but Archimedes gets the E grab. <coughs> and tosses it off to Akis, who thrusts Pax away. This flag is still out here. He got conked, it looked like, by implosions. Yeah, MOBA equals lame. Indeed, Game Critic. Indeed, sir. Eureka. Eureka. Ortiz. Eureka. What the? What the? I don't know. Conk out. Here comes E-Grab. Can he get it? No! Lazy shuts him down. Able to get him with a disc. Akis, meanwhile, dropping that flag for a Voss. Lazy now tossing it off to Seek. We're going to move over here to the Blood Eagle side of things. As Hasselhoff and Firebad are in position for a push, but Hasselhoff in a fatty. Just stuck. He's going to actually be tossing mortars in the back. Firebad going in alone. He has been spotted. Conks are out. Voss is up in the air, and he's going to get chain gunned down. They need one more guy to come in. There it is. Clemson guy coming in from behind. Gets a shot off. Gets the kill. Clemson guy with the return for Diamond Sword. Here comes Seek. Blood Eagles nowhere to be found for this uh, e-grab. Here comes the... Oh, there's actually a heavy inside the base. Not going to happen. Diamond Sword wins 4-3 to three here in OT. And we're going to map number two, which is fucking rain dance. Oh, absolutely, Red Sentinel. Absolutely. I actually already cast uh, Sweet JP sent me two replays uh, that I ended up casting. They're on my YouTube channel. Don't bother watching episode one. It's really bad. I tried to use the controller with soft lock on the ball, and it, it was miserable but then I fixed the controls so free roam was a little more doable and uh, it ended up being a lot better so what's going on now all right so uh uh, thanks, Flopsy. I appreciate you. All right, I'm going to take a quick break. I will be right back. Hopefully they pile onto one team and it's, you know, you know how it is. I'll be right back. Well, that's how it is, Game Critic. That's how it is, man. It's rain. It. <sighs> Freaking rain dance. God damn it. At least it's not in Euro.
They stacked. Awesome. Um. Yeah, no, Game Critic. My problem with Rain Dance is, um, here, I'll show you. Is that Tribes Ascend is a momentum game. More so, well, not more so, but, um, it's more important than it has been in previous tribes, where if you screwed up, you still had the momentum to fix what you were doing. So it it's not as important. Like, it's hard to explain, but if you screw up on Rain Dance, it takes forever to get across. You know, not even just as a capper. And if you spawn, like, back here... I mean, back here is not too bad. You can disc jump twice in a heavy and get over there and you'll... Anyway, it takes forever to get across. There needs... This mountain back here needs to be bigger. This needs to be bigger. And then look at it. Look at it in... In the other games. This this hill... Not that tall in the other games. So they're piling on to the correct teams now. Um, it also, it just, it, and like, the routes just take forever. Um, it works a lot better. Uh, some of the best games I've had in Tribes Ascend were actually uh, during the 10v10 trials on this map. And it was awesome. The problem with that is Tribes Ascend is more geared the way the armor and the damage works. It's way geared more towards 7v7s. And this game, this map, has always worked in tribes except for this one. Even in, I mean, even in the 7v7s for T1, it's still doable because you can get across in a heavy in 30 seconds instead of about a minute. Anyway, that's my spiel. We're golden. 25 minutes on the clock. Give a run down to the rosters. They're the same as they were before. For Frell's team, we have Ponfar Implosions, Aikis, Dracula, Archimedes, Voss, and Egrab. <coughs> Archimedes, a.k.a. Mr. Salt. Diamond Sword, we have for Lazy's team. We have Urtiza, Firebad, Lazy, Clemson Guy, Word Thompsonian, Seek, and Hasselhoff, who is the Hoff. We have 11 viewers in the channel. Welcome, everybody. Like what you see, hit that follow button. Boom! Voss with an MA shot on Word Top Sony coming in the back. As we're going to pop back up. See what's going on over here. Looks like Diamond Sword under a little pressure here. Dracula and Archimedes trying to clear it. There goes Akis with a grab for Blood Eagle. <laughs> Looks like he lost a lot of speed on that uh, flag stand. Must have, might have taken a disc. Wrecked a lot of his momentum, looks like. Let's go down inside the base and see who has been paying their power bill. Diamond Sword has been paying their power bill. And Blood Eagle has been paying their power bill. So both teams still with power. Those turrets... Oh, no, this is the other version. There are no base turrets in this. And the V-pad uh, still exists, at least. But the sensor is down, I think. Yeah, no sensor, no turrets, no nothing. Just a V-pad. Which is fine for this map, damn it. So Jen's really not that important, especially, actually, yeah. See, if if force fields were allowed, that's another thing I don't like about Tribes of Sin. When it's 7v7, the whole base rape part of the game gets lost, and Tribes of Sin really wasn't geared towards it. They just got it wrong, I feel like. Another reason why it doesn't work well with 10v10s, which is damn... Damn shame. Damn a shame. Let's go old T1 days. You hop into a giant fucking map with 30v30. It was ridiculous. Word Thompsonian. And Seek coming through. Seek missed. Word Thompsonian didn't. And neither did Voss. Akis with a grab for a Blood Eagle. But he it looks like he actually face planted right there. There's a smidgen somewhere there. Yeah, he left that, that dent right there. That little... Oh, my God. That dent right there. You see it? Yeah. Mm-hmm. That dent right there. Clemson guy, meanwhile, kicking it in to the flag tower, I guess. 
you would call it? I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, I used to play the Jeopardy theme on this map. I don't think I can get away with that anymore. Blood Eagle closing in on the base. You see Achaeus in the back running a route. Please run two cappers. Please run two cappers. Archimedes uh, setting up. Looks like Dracula ran into Firebat and Clemson guy. He's almost got Clemson guy. Gets Clemson guy. Now he's free to go after Firebird. Firebat, who has just spotted Achaeus, pops him once, missed, but now the Hoff knows. Hasselhoff the Hoff turning around. Force field is up. I thought they got rid of force fields. I guess not. Flag is dead. Clemson guy gets that return. Oh, not just uh, ESL, but uh, DLG is putting up a league. And um, with the the casts I did, some people sent them to the people who were kind of in charge of casting and uh, kind of got me my foot in the door. So I'm, I'm looking forward to it. I really love the game. I like to play it, too. So we're, we're five minutes in, and that's that's that that that's what we have to show for it. <coughs> um, I don't remember what it's called, but yeah, DLG. Oh my! See, hi Res. That bug was supposed to be fixed, like, two years ago. <laughs> uh, yeah. Red Sentinel, you got that right. I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. I, I truly hope that the problem with Tribe Just Send <laughs> that is a loaded topic. Hang on. So Voss under a lot of damage here for the Blood Eagle stand here. Uh, Word Thompsonian and Ortiz are dropping mortars left and right on that thing. Akis has picked it up for Blood Eagle, but he goes down. As it looks like, uh, yeah, indeed, he went down. Hoff is down. Looking for a Diamond Sword Capper. There's Seek coming in now in about five. Down on it now. Voss is going to miss. He misses it. And he doesn't get back in time. Seek's going to get away with this thing. Does get sniped once by Ponfar. Sniped twice. Here comes that Chang'e fire. He is going to go down. And no one from Diamond Sword able to move it along. Ha ha ha. Hey, Moth. That's right. Yeah. Yeah, that bug. Um, no. But the, the core way that Tribes Ascend is built, like the base, like the way the innards are handled doesn't take advantage of what the community has to offer to the game itself. And so if they do decide, and they have, from the day that they said, even though they always lie, I would like to believe that from day one, from dropping, essentially dropping Tribes Ascend, they have always said, we will be making a Tribes Ascend 2. When that actually happens, I don't know. But I just hope they get the infrastructure correct this time. That's that's what I hope. That That is my two cents. Meanwhile, Seek is out with this thing for Diamond Sword. He's got one stinking health. Look at that. One. One. And he gets shotgun from behind by E-Grab. And E-Grab gets that return. Son of a bitch. 
It is still a big surprise, nil-nil, with 17 minutes left to go. What shall we talk about now, gentlemen? Anything? Let's talk about Rocket League. I'm just kidding. Ake is coming through. Taken out by that forest field, though. Skadooshed. Uh, it is game critic. But it's not supposed to happen on structures. It's supposed to happen on rocks. And they claimed they fixed it about a year and a half ago. About two patches before their last patch. And they never did. Oh, yes. The weather is absolutely lovely. You know what's really awesome? Unless your graphics are on, like, super high. Do you notice anything kind of weird? It's like the rain only appears in the skybox. Akis coming in. He's through. Clean. Gone. Goodbye, baseball. 900 health. Took a little bit of chain gun fire from the Hoff from behind. He did take a snipe right there. Down to 6-4. Uh, Moving across midfield. Looking good. Looking around. Trying to see if he's got any chase. Word Thompsonian is behind him. And he's not going to catch him. We might have the first cap. Please, God. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Akis with the cursed cap. Puts Blood Eagle up 1-0. And now the strikes have entered play. And implosions runs down. We're Thompsonian. So let's just, 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 let's just stick on implosions here. Seek coming in for a grab. It gets buddy blocked by Voss. Arteza did get a grab, but Voss gets the kill. See, so yeah, how does that happen? How does the rain have a hitbox? What the hell is Hi what is the hell is Hyrus doing? Uh, I will always like them for making another tribes game, but I can never forgive them for how badly they screwed it up. And I I, I really hope that they learned a lot of lessons with this one. And they say they did. And I believe them because Smite is huge now. And whatever their other game is, Paladins, is looking like it's got a following. So, you know, it's, it's what it is. Blood Eagle, another cap there. No, he gets diced off. Implosions, no health. He's going to toss it off to Voss, who gets the cap, the Hoff. Bada boom. This is happening. We have grabbed by Seek. <coughs> Seek is moving away. Where the hell did my getter go? There it is. Seek moving away. 426 to the Pathfinder. Moving past the midfield tower here. Down to 203 now. <coughs> he grabbed. Try to put some last uh, pot shots on him. And <coughs> he's going to toss it off and implosions. Gets the return on the flag stand. The capper was about to die. He tries to toss it off to La Hoff. I don't know if Hasselhoff knew that it just happened. And Implosion's got the E-grab and the return in one fatal swoop. So Diamond Sword again denied on the flag stand. That's happened a lot to Lazy's team tonight. Just like... 
Unfortunate, unfortunate, unfortunate. Dude, if they do that, I'm going to shit a brick. Um, <coughs> even, like, right now, what I'm looking forward to is called Midair. It's what it was known as Project Z. It's a bunch of tribers. They made, um... Oh, God, what's that one game? It was exactly like Tribes. It was just, I can't remember the name of it. They had, like, a special jetpack that you, like, fucking super saiyan and just flew around. Very popular, but, you know, after Tribes SN was such a letdown, they decided, let's do a proper FPSC, and it looks fantastic. It's more like a, a futuristic Borderlands 2 art style. And I got to play a demo at PAX two years ago, um, and it was just to get the the physics, just to see how they were going to handle the physics. And it was fantastic. It felt like T1, um, but it played more like T2. And it was just fantastic. So, uh, yeah, watch out for that one. I, I hope I need to get a hold of Bug Spray. I hope they have something playing at PAX at the end of the month. PAX Prime, I will be there all four days. If you are they, there, let me know. I would like to say hello. Grab some food or a beer. It's amazing how many parties I get invited to now. It's weird. They'll pass... The last year, I was invited to three different after parties, and the year before that, it was like five different after parties. Anchor, so the grab for Blood Eagle, he's off once again in a Pathfinder. 539, moving along and looking good. He's out of sight from that sniper. However, the flag was grabbed by Word Thompsonian. Kind of an e grab here. E grab. Man, that word screws me up. E grab trying to give chase. Not going to happen. He's taken out by Lazy and Word Thompsonian. Word Thompson is going to drop it off for Lazy, who misses the uh, toss off. Who failed the baton toss right there. Meanwhile, Dracula, and we are set up. Uh, no, Red said no, it's because they've actually been working. Every once in a while, if you check their Twitter, they'll have model updates and stuff. But it, they're busy. So, yeah. That's why. So implosion. The I mean, part of the problem is uh, it's uh, there's people who aren't even on the in the U.S. It's 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 a digital company, really. So until it's all put together, they don't really have anything to release except for art. I'll get a hold of, hold of bug spray. So Akis is all alone over here. I think Blood Eagle might be de-stacking a little bit. Let me see here. No? We're watching Voss now. Got left alone. Implosions is there with him. Ortiz and Clemson guy are there. Voss taking a lot of damage here. Uh, grenade goes off. Ortiz is still giving chase. Clemson guy is there as well. Voss up in the air. Taking a lot of chain of fire. And Implosions and Pomfar able to clean up everybody. And Diamond Sword's flag is also secure. Well... It still makes sense. I know, I because I've I've talked to Bug Spray since then. He's always bugging me to go get a beer. Uh, but he's been super busy, so I know they're working on it. So, and from what I've heard, they're supposed to have something at PAX, but I need to confirm it. Either way, I'm excited. Watching where Tom Sony and he's all alone, lazy, no health there. Dracula now with a sliver. Akis giving chase. There's a conk. Flag goes out. He accidentally punts it. And Blood Eagle is gonna get this return. Kind of easy peasy. However, looks like Firebad got a conk off on Hasselhoff. But Voss is up in the air. Chinger fire up. Oh, not gonna happen. Blood Eagle pushes her lead to three to nothing. 
And there's E-Grab for Blood Eagle with a grab. He kicks a bolt and a conk from Word Thomasonian. <coughs> yes, it is very good to know. That is what my understanding is. I still need to... I'm not entirely sure what's going on. But someone else told me that some there was something at PAX. So, I hope. <coughs> it's amazing I have kept you all viewing this during this goddamn map. Firebear with a grab for Diamond Sword. Looking good. 900 health. Whoa, that... Brute Fuser was really close. But Firebad moving away now. Implosions giving chase with that. Whoa! Look out! No! Implosions! What are you doing? Foot 80! 130! Oh, he's up in the air. They're gonna have to run him over or get the last shot off. 130, not gonna happen. E grab is made by Akis. Hasselhoff has his flag, but no health at all. Implosions fizz finishes him off with the nose of his strike. We're Tom Sony and now trying to. Stay away. Archimedes coming in now. Implosion's just brutal with this strike. Still plenty of health in this thing. Now here comes Dracula and Ponfar. Implosion's still being a nuisance. As he does go down finally and Ponfar is going to get that return. Meanwhile, over on the other side, he was picked up by Voss. Trying to move it back to his base. But Seek giving chase with a double spin fuser and an assault rifle. But it's not going to happen. Voss gets the cap and moves their lead up to 4 to nothing with... Approaching, yeah, they do. They really do need a miracle. There goes Firebat once again. Looks like he did get sniped once. And uh, twice. 65 health moving away, though. He's out of line of sight for now. Punfar sees him. One. And two shots missed. Firebat still moving along. 65 health. And just waiting for his team to come over here. There's Seek in the background. As here comes Implosions in that strike. Ponfar trying to squeeze off whatever he can. Not going to happen. And we're going to pull off there and move to this camera. Akis giving chase. Firebad drops the flag. It's down. Hasselhoff off the flag stand. Going after it. He's got it. Implosions trying to come in. Not going to happen. And Diamond Sword on the scoreboard for finally. Oh, that's not, that's not very nice, Moth. It is a draft turning after all. Here comes Seek. No dice. Voss and E-Grab were ready for it. So Akis has a grab. He got through. The force field was too late. Blood Eagle cleaning up that sniper hill, trying to keep their flag carrier clean right now, but he, he skied right into Clemson guy. Clemson guy gets the MA on Akis. Dr Dracula gets the final kill on Clemson guy. Moving away now. He tries to toss it off to Implosions, who had his momentum, but missed it. Not sure Implosions was ready for it. Dracula moving away. Lazy trying to give chase now. Implosions trying to light him up. Here comes a strike for Diamond Sword. It's Word Thompsonian coming in now. Dracula, Lazy able to come in. Word Thompson kicks the flag around. Clemson guy now co uh, coming in. But it's Implosions who has the flag now. Seek with an E-grab. It was a real grab. But he gets sniped. Word Thompsonian going for it now. E grab is there. Able to kick Word Thompsonian out of the way. And he's going to get that return. Voss now has this flag. Clemson guy is there. Tries to toss it off to Dracula. Clemson guy, no. Lazy, no. Dracula is there. The conk is out. Lazy trying to fall on it. No. Just short. Word Thompsonian, whose strike was still alive. As it's grabbed by Blood Eagle. Just tries to kick it open over. Implosions drops it off for Akis, who thrusts up into the air. Here comes Akis, Firebag giving chase. Akis, flag stand cap, and Blood Eagle has finally locked the door 5-1 to one, with two minutes to go.
Yeah, pretty much. Watching Par and Far, he sees Firebad coming in! And Firebad with the grab. He's now getting chased by E-Grab. Firebad now has this 433 moving away. Gets sniped by Ponfar once and gets sniped by Ponfar twice. Bye bow e E-Grab is going to get that return. No, he's not. We're Thompsonian. Swoops it through. It gets out with that flag at midfield and he's moving away. But look out. Here comes the bike. It's going to be a shh. Whoa, look out. <laughs> As Archimedes trying to give chase here. Runs right into Implosions, who plants that CJ5, whatever it's called, right in his back. What is it? NJ4? That's not it's an NJ5, sir. And that flag is dropped by Implosions up the hill. <coughs> and Implosions gets that return, and the cap is made by Akis. 6-1 to one with 45 seconds to go. Firebad. Oh, Jesus. Wow, he actually hit the top with the music. That's pretty awesome. <laughs> yeah, you know, I, th I think they're just having fun at this point, guys. Whee! Firebat is back. Firebat is there. However, Ponfar has it as well. Seven, six... Five, four, three, two, one, zero, and that is all. She wrote, I'm gonna take you. Or, no, I'm not. I need to go hop in the other server and see what is going on. Boop. Um, and we're gonna switch over to here so I don't show you all the passwords. I'm smarter than that. Here we go. Boop. Back in yet. Okay. Now. We are on map number two. It is three to one in favor of Blood Eagle, who is... Free Foods team, Chetix, Free Food, Cantaloupe, Zombie of the Past, Team Deagle, Shadow Trobes, and Dash. And Diamond Sword uh, for Dodoro's team. We have Dodoro, Walden, Blast Man, Persuasion Laser, Wangatang, C. Sekero, and Air Blooded. Uh, midfield something. What was their name? Hang on. I have it here. Their name is Midfield Monsters. At least that's what it says. I don't know if that's actually true. Um, midfield LD, I guess. Whatever. D stackers, essentially. So, yeah. And apparently it hasn't worked so far. Not sure who took map one. I feel like it was a hefty shutout from Free Foods team. Here comes Dash with a clean grab. Not so much. He did get dissed. Right on the flag stem, drops him down to 310, misses the thumper shot, but it's fine. He's going to try to recatch it just for esports' sake. And no, he's going to fall short. And <laughs> squish. Free food trying to make a run for it. Dodoro and Air Blooded coming over, as well as Blast Man, Persuasion, Laser, Zell, everybody from Dobbin Sword crashing, except for Walden. It looks like Free Food does get there first, though, and he's moving away with it now. Lots of Chingo Car coming from behind. He's in a soldier. So no help, really, from trying to run away. Shadow Trobe's giving chase from behind. Oh, my God. Dodoro coming through with that eagle pistol. Whatever the hell it's called. Nova Colt. Whatever it's called. <laughs> thump, thump, and dead. Oh, Zombie of the Past gets C. Sicero as the Huff. Let's take a look at the um, teams. No, I did the teams. Uh, the kills, that's what I want to look at. Dodoro leading the way with 23. That's not really a surprise. Brute, brute shot. And, and uh, yeah. Chetix has 22 for Blood Eagle. Yeah. 
So there you go. Past the five minute mark, three to one. Chenix has grabbed the flag. Get a lock on him now, thank you. He is in a brute going nowhere. Persuasion laser with the uh, shotgun gets the kill. However, Shadow Trobes is there. And moving away, and Wang Tang 69 coming in with that chain gun fire. And a little LAR brings him down. Actually, he's got a assault rifle. He's a soldier. And while Dan doing the sniping duties for tonight for a diamond sword. Where'd you go? There you are. Trying to do it all epic like you fucked it up. See Sekero with a grab. Got a lock. No! Taken out by Team Deagle with that snipe shot. Right as I locked on, that was a beautiful. Get some right in the gut. And that flag is secure. Boop. And so is that one. Oop. I heard a bike. Oh, it is a bike that is full. It's Dodoro and Blastman. Runs right into free food. Dodoro bails. Free food bails. Oh, free food went down, I should say. Blastman bailed. As uh, trying to get over there quickly. Takes about as long when you try to get in <laughs> Jotaro moving across Blastman trying to give uh, take a little bit of cover here to try to regain his health try to deal with Team Deagle who's just taking pot shots waiting for free food to come and help does so now and now they're dueling off Dodoro while Deagle gets off Blastman now would be a good time for the capper but no dice zombie of the past was there to deny it and as you can see, just one capper being used by Diamond Sword. Meanwhile, Dash is out with this thing in a technician. Must might have been a straight grab. I'm not entirely sure. Moving away, it's gonna be a push to Cantaloupe. Nice pass off right there. Wing of Tank giving chase. He goes down from Cantaloupe. Now here comes Air Blooded and Blastman. Blastman getting his regen. He was almost dead. Cantaloupe has to toss it off to a teammate. It's gonna be free food. <coughs> He's taking a little bit of damage, but Blastman goes down. Team Deagle with the snipe. Free food gets drilled by air blooded, air blooded in a brute. Can he get this return? Shadow Trobes just trying to keep it away from him, and air blooded gets that return. So Diamond Sword able to deny Blood Eagle another cap. We do have a grab by Chedix now. Chedix brute for Blood Eagle. Moving away, he takes a disc jump there. Now here comes that Nova Colt or whatever the hell it's called. Moving away, 351. Boom! Taken out. Air blooded. Coming in. With that thing, whatever the hell it's called. Won't tell me what it is because HUD Brud. OBS HUD broken. Thank you very much. <coughs> Hi, Riz. <clears throat> Excuse me. Two minutes to go. Minute 50. 3 1. Blood Eagle. Free Foods team. Run down to the scores. Dodoro leading the way with 28. Walled in 20 for Diamond Sword. Free Food and Shedix 1922, respectively. Respectively. Novical. Yeah, okay. I don't know. I never used it. I, I tried. I'm going to call it a hack because it changes what the game is. It changes the experience. That's what it is. Whether it's accepted by the community is up for debate. I don't like it. But it is what it is. And when I tried to use it, I couldn't hit shit. I was better without it. So there. Same with the chain. So here comes the crash. Blastman and... Oh, eSports. Yay. It's wasted on this map, man. I'm sorry. <laughs> Zizakero is off with it. Little nice little eSports. So grab with a toss to a capper. 45 seconds to go. Let's see if they can move this thing back. I think the offense wanted to stay there. Now, there goes the offense. Let's see if they can get another one off. They do have parked a tank here. Diamond Sword bringing it within, within one with 30 seconds to go. And see, Sekiro has left on a route. I would send more than one capper, guys. Oh, yeah, no. See the Red Sentinel? That's... I completely agree, but, you know, the gun is what the gun is when it's in game. Here comes C. Sakura. He had absolutely no hope. No hope. That's going to be it. 
So I'm not entirely sure what's going on now. Um, let's see. Round. Oh no. Okay. No, we're not. Okay. There we go. I see. Never mind. I see. <laughs> I think we gotta fight another. So there are two more rounds. So I'm gonna take a break because my throat needs it. I'll be right back. I'm gonna drop from the uh, the stream. I will be back in say five to ten minutes. Uh, whatever server I find will be whatever game I cast. Uh, so yeah. Thanks for watching. I'll be right back. Bye-bye.